So we need to know who the final three are. Who do you think is going to be joining us tonight as a juror? Beast Mode Cowboy. Cowboy, yeah. Caleb. Cowboy. <laughs> why do you say that? Uh, he's completely outnumbered, and no one's going to send Victoria home, because why would you send Victoria home? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Donnie, are these guys right? Yeah, I, absolutely. I That's think true. it will be Beast Mode Cowboy tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I'd love to see Cody walk through the door. Cody didn't do much this game at all. Yes, it, Cody. It, well, let's find out who it is. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's see who it is. Yeah. Beautiful, look at you. Frankie. Hello, buddy. Have a seat, everybody. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Will. I missed you guys a lot. So, you know, oh, wow. I, this is what happened. I couldn't play in the HOH. Derek ended up winning it. Cody ended up winning the veto. Yeah. Of course, they told me I was safe all week. Next thing you know, Cody gets up and he says that uh, him and Derek have had a, an alliance since day two called the Hitman. Jocasta, what do you think about this? Oh my, I think it's quite interesting you got rid of Frankie, because he's really worked with you this entire game. Besides I when he that tried to get me thrown on the block with Nicole. You know, Caleb, I mean, actions speak louder than words. My actions in this game have never been disloyal to you, ever. You walking up to Nicole and saying, hey, you've got to put Caleb on the block, that's Caleb, an action. Caleb, that's not an action, it's a word. I pulled you off the block twice. I would have taken you to that final three, Caleb. You know that. In your soul, I would have gotten you to that final three. Guys, I'm fascinated by this, but we do need to get back to discussing the people who are still in the house. Let's talk about Derek specifically for a moment. What is the most powerful aspect of his game? Derek thinks a lot before he speaks, and that's, you know, a great aspect. He is, uh, by golly, I don't even know if I can say it right, manipulative. <laughs> <laughs> he, he uses such strong uh, things, like his child. He did it to me with my grandfather and yeah. his grandfather. Yeah, see what I'm mean? I would the never backstab that... you because we both lost our grandfathers in this game, and that brings us closer than anything else possibly could. He's so likable, and he's the family guy. It's got him through the whole game. Yeah, mm -hmm. you feel guilty when he betrays yeah. you. You feel guilty. Yeah. 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 Yes. He made me feel yeah. guilty several times, saying that it's... I'm going to look back, and I'm going to be so disappointed in myself. I don't know anybody that has made it to the final three and has never been on the block, not one time. Yeah, we forgot about that. Yeah. Especially being in a, with a B.O.B., with four people being nominated yeah. every week. That's he has not been on the block one impressive time. That's impressive statistic. Very impressive, impressive statistic. So at the end of the day, is he a master manipulator, or did he just have an alliance with everybody, and eventually okay, something was done? Yeah. Like, there are other yeah. people in the house that tried that theory, and it did not work. Yeah. So the fact that it worked for him means that he is a master manipulator, yeah, because it, none of them blew up in his face. But he stabbed his friends in the back, and uh, he tried to work them as they was going out the door to work the jury. <laughs> he has enough in this jury that he has lied to and huge lies that I would say, I don't want to send six of my friends in the jury that I have immediately lied to because they probably won't give me my vote after that. He was fake praying with me. That's something you don't do with me. I don't play that. So, so you're going to hold that against him? That so I'm going to keep it. Yeah, I'm going to hold keep... on to it, squeeze it tight, pour all the lemon out of it. It's going to stay bitter. Ain't no sugar going to come in that baby. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Is there anything wrong with outright manipulation, lying, pulling on your heartstrings. Is that allowed here? I yeah. said I would lie, cheat, steal, and kill to win this game. So I, res I respect his game a lot. Yeah. Everybody praises uh, Derek more so than Cody, and what? I think that's they're, what e that's I what think I don't they're understand. equally worthy. Cody does Co a lot of Co talking for Derek. And Cody yep. was more capable of winning competitions than Derek. Yep. Cody, he did not show his full potential at the beginning of this game. Right. When there was less people, he shows up. The kid is smart. He's very yeah. smart. He really did play under the radar for a while. I, I, I think he had found a good person to align with. He threw competitions. He started winning when he had to. I have nothing against Cody. He is flawless. He should win the game. I believe his best move was getting so much information and not saying a thing about it. Yes. Caleb, who flipped you against me? You know, was it Derek or was it Cody? As an honest answer, it was both of them hammering me. I think since day I two, think, they yeah. decided to stick together so. and they played each and every one of us yep. to get there, and I am so impressed. You yes. guys said that there was a lot of strategic moves that Derek made, but what was his one best move? Wow. I can't, I mean, I can't think of one right off the bat. I heard that. If you're in the final three, you've done something right. Yeah. right. Yeah. Uh, Hunter brings up it's Victoria. It's no, 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 no. That's a whole nother ball. Honestly, the girl was on the block 
nine times. Both times I was on the block, I had complete nervous breakdowns. She's been on the block nine times. That takes strength. Victoria yeah. thinks she's at summer camp. You guys are in the jury house. You're at summer camp. She's playing Big Brother. Right. Oh, right. yikes. I think, I don't think Victoria is very smart, but I do think she is definitely dumbing down uh, her personality in the house. She has moments where she releases this extra bit of smartness. Yeah, she does. She's, she's Never seen it. You know, yeah. she done she... something right or she wouldn't be here. You have to act dumber and survive. Yeah. That's Guys, true. it's a strategy. She's not acting dumb, though. I think a little bit. She I'm... is dumb. She has no idea she's playing Big Brother. She hasn't won a competition. She couldn't you win You don't have to win like... things to be the best at Big Brother. Victoria has no chance in winning. I am going to vote for her, because I'm sorry. That would be amazing. It's... Victoria, win. Dom got you far. No, that means no she's very smart. Yes. I'm going to tell you guys now, if Victoria is in that final two, giving her speech, oh. I'm voting for her. No. Simple as that. Yikes. But that's because of a personal burn, right? Yeah. Because of Derek and Cody? I wouldn't say it's a personal burn. It's just the fact that no one thought that she would ever get there. But that's, wait, what, what are we voting for? Just who we want well, to win or who played a okay, better game? I think that's an excellent question. What's the most important factor in choosing a winner? To me, competitions are huge, but I think playing people without getting caught. Social game? Yeah, yeah. social okay, game. Okay, so social that's, game. I'm just overwhelmed right now. I don't, I don't even know what I'm gonna do. This is making me think 10 times deeper than I ever have. Guys, there's still a lot of game left to be played because we don't know who the final two are gonna be. And in a moment, you guys are gonna get together as a jury and decide which questions to ask them. Our conversation tonight, in conjunction with those questions, will carry extreme weight, so please choose your questions very wisely.